Then we went to the other side of the equation in another financial industry, or financial giant, uh, where they have a lot of resources because they're protecting some very important things. And they engaged with us early because they saw it was a way to have true last mile control and ensure the data, uh, disclosure events in particular, would never occur. Um, they saw that they liked the idea of secure browser and controlling the tokens. All these other things were important. But how we handled the data, their critical customer data, was a, a big item. And they built an RPA. And what I loved about that robotic process automation that they did is it was checking to make sure that as data was applied or data was pushed into a record, that the right data end up in the right record. And why I love that use case so much is no DLP on the planet could, could control that because data was moving where it was supposed to. But if my records got put into your account, your records got put into my account, all of a sudden we've got a nightmare scenario, but DLP can never stop it. And the ability for that to be something the customer built in the proof of concept, unbeknownst to us, and literally showed us, was just inspiring. I, I, I thought that was one of the coolest things that, that we've seen. And then there's all the clean room stuff for the legal firms that we, we seem to be finding, the point of sale devices, those are really interesting. And I don't even know how many contractors were enabled at this point um, between the actual contracting firms and the BYOs and you know everybody's third-party access. There's just so many fun use cases. Mm -hmm.